Hey, good evening. It's uh, Friday evening, March 27th. Time for some uh, every night thoughts. Thanks so much for, again, your being around, and I hope this is comforting to you tonight. What I'm going to talk about tonight is comforting to me, and see if we can work through this. Psalm 23, verse 1, says, The Lord is my shepherd, I have no needs, or I have all that I need, depending upon the translation that you have. The old King James says, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Now think that through with me a little bit. I have no needs, I have all that I need. Well, I can think of a bunch of things that I think I need. And some of them legitimate. But you see, what the Holy Spirit is saying through David here is that you have everything that you need to serve God. And later on in Psalm 23, he talks about doing things so he can bring honor to God. Because God is the purpose of our life. He is our direction. And it's, he has promised to sustain us in all that we do if our focus is to trust him and that whatever we do will bring honor to his name. Not my name, but his name. So as Paul says, whether I'm a plenty or I'm a want, even if I don't have anything, even if I'm hurting physically, even if I have a disease, even if I've had something that's been really hard relationally, I have all that I need because I have God. I have Christ. He is my peace my rock. He's my resting place. See, that's always true. So regardless of whether you're in a very difficult situation, maybe one that only you know about, maybe it's one that has you know, bigger applications like the coronavirus or some threat of something coming. I remember as a kid growing up in Miami, and sometimes a hurricane would be forecast, and so there would be this time of waiting, wondering, is it going to hit? And the forecasting then was not nearly as good as it is now. So there was a lot of uncertainty. Well, God wasn't promising me that the hurricane would not come. He wasn't promising me that no damage would come. He was promising me that he would be enough for me at that time. So this is what he's saying to you today. He's not saying, I'm going to make all your problems go away. He's saying, I will be with you in your problems. All the things that cause you stress, that cause the weigh down on you. God's not saying, your ability to be stress-free doesn't mean these things go away. This means that I'm going to be with you. I will give you the strength that you need so that you can bring honor to my name. See, if my focus, if my focus is to bring honor to God, then I do have all that I need. This night, as you get ready for bed, and your stress level might be high, what God wants you to do is to bring honor to Him. Let Him take care of the rest. That's something you can rest on in peace. You have a great night. Thanks for being here, and we'll see you tomorrow. Lord bless.